Hi, I'm Jacqueline Woods, and this is a show of recent work I've done. The Tool Room is exhibiting a group of my photographs. I've been in the dark room for 30 years, and this is um, the culmination of that. Um, the last 10 years, I've been moving towards cameraless work, and so all of these images um, are made literally with no um, film or camera, totally in the dark room. Um, these, these prints are all black and white, but I'm using special chemistry and using the process of solarization. And, cr and based on the silver content of the print itself, it creates, the light creates color. So um, that's how these prints are generated. When I'm printing these uh, suns or landscapes, I am not completely in control, so there's an element of accident and chance when I'm working in the dark with the chemistry and, and just a few props to, in order to create a horizon and to create a, a sun. And uh, the beauty of it is that every piece of paper is different, every chemical reaction is different, and so I am able to just sort of intuit as I'm sitting there in the dark room and it's very exciting because every print's completely different and I, I don't know exactly what I'm going to get. Um, and so they're sort of wonderful little, little surprises and they, and they are sort of little universes unto themselves. Jacqueline's thinking very far outside the yeah. ordinary photographic box and I, I think that's amazing. She yeah. doesn't use yeah. lenses and, and yeah, I mean, traditional cameras. She, she makes imagery in, in a very unique kind of manner, and I think that's quite brilliant. It's beautiful imagery to boot, so it, it, what's, what winds up on the, uh, in the frame is, is quite extraordinary, and, and finding out how it was made is even more extraordinary. Fortunately, I have a curator here that helped me choose the prints, uh, but I wanted to keep it pretty much about the black sun, the solarized sun, and um, there's some crescent moons and some fictitious planets that I snuck in there, but essentially they're all different, they're all unique, so um, I've made about a hundred prints and this is about 15 of them. I suggest again at, that, that I believe that the medium of traditional photography is very supernatural because of the alchemy of chemistry and light. And this really goes back to the infancy of photography. Um, even the, the very first photographers also looked at the heavens and also wanted to record the universe such as we know it. So I'm just picking up the same, same themes, essentially, that go way back. I'm very much a minimalist. I've always been a minimalist in terms of my career and in appreciating other art forms as well. Less is more, and, and by my way of thinking, you know, literarily and photographically and cinematographically, I think you know the people who speak the softest voice are often the most talented amongst us. I've always thought that, and I feel that about her work as well. It's really subtle, and, and just it speaks volumes in a tiny little piece of a, of a page which I appreciate about her work.